a very good evening and warm welcome to ICIA. So today we have a wonderful guest who is going to deliver his insights on the corporate tax, especially on the event highlights on the publication of the loan. So I heartily welcome Mr. Amit Mehta from UHI Gangs. Thank you. Hi, Amit. Thank you. So uh, let's start with a quick round of uh, mm. before the sections. So uh, what will the quick insights you want to share uh, that will be impacting in the UAE market when it moves to a corporate structure, corporate tax structure? Yeah, actually, when we when we say a corporate tax, and it is for UAE, then one, one has to diligently take care of the structuring about the group transactions, how they're handling. When we say that transfer pricing is there, not only for the, I would say, foreign business transaction, but there's a domestic transfer pricing. Domestic transfer business is also been impacted by the transfer pricing regulation. So one has to ensure that, make sure that what the transaction they are doing with their related party must be at arm in price. Okay. That will actually will going to give a big, uh, big concern, or I would say, it will be something that one has to take care while while planning for corporate tax. Okay, and uh, when we say on the planning part, yes, transfer pricing along with some disallowable expenses are also there. And one need to understand which in which category they are they, they belong to. Okay. Because when we say that applicability of the corporate tax, they are different categories as a legal person, as a natural person, okay. as a, a free zone, uh, qualified free zone person is also there, exempt person is also there. Okay. Usually the question comes to us like, what about the renter incomes that they are earning, yeah, whether yeah. it will be taxed or not. Definitely, so there's a big definitely. question uh, now where we can say that we should wait for some more time, let the executive regulation come out okay. because what the definition is given for the business now is that actually brings brings that right. that income under yeah. the ambit of corporate tax that right. is taxable at the rate of 9%. Okay, right. And uh, so definitely we will wait for the executive regulations to be published. But however, uh, what will be the steps, especially the SME sectors, uh, should focus on keeping their books updated with the corporate tax? Uh, you talk about the disallowances, you talk about uh, uh, the related party transactions, but what the key highlights they have to focus from now so that they can enter into tax uh, sector in a free mode. Yeah, it's a it's a question on. I, I'll tell you, frankly, it's is very difficult to answer them in a in a one or two sentence. But yes, when we are talking about the planning part, yes, first first point is that our tax, our book profit, where we are, where actually what we calculate, what we get from our auditors, and after that, how we have to calculate and drive the net taxable income on which nine percent will be. Charge. Mm -hmm. So, in that factors like disallowable expenses, arm length, non uh, following, or the mm -hmm. I would say uh, transfer pricing compliances are not been done, then how to take the relief, or if, we, if they go for the task grouping, some release yeah. is also there. Task grouping, how they can take the benefits. There, for I, I can say the for tax is documentation is the essence. Mm -hmm. If okay. you have a good documentation, they do, and you can justify what you are claiming. That's a, that's a key. Definitely. So, I can say about planning, understanding where you are, then where you want to go, then have a proper documentation, follow their policy, and take it forward. Great, great. So, thank you, Amoyed, for sharing the brief knowledge. And definitely, we will have a detailed section relating to the applicabilities of the corporate tax uh, that will be in our YouTube channel. Uh, kindly you can follow there also Amit with that. Thank you Amit uh, and thank you on behalf of ICA Abu Dhabi chapter. Thank you. Thank you.